boss watching America's Next Top Model, so what do you do? Play on Team Viewer. Uh, this is cool, man. This Team Viewer application for the iPad is um, is pretty cool. There's the icon. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Team Viewer through, say, from my iPad. I'm going to go up to a computer that is probably, I don't know, 100 kilometers away. Or it could be the other side of the world for all that matters. And then I'm going to come back to something like my laptop over here. And then I'm going to go to our home computer. Or the other way around. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so we'll launch TeamViewer. Oh. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Logging in. And there's my computer. And once we get on this computer, it should be a bit of fun. Authenticating. There we go. Okay, so I'm logged into this computer. Now, TeamViewer is very cool. It is a uh, free piece of software. But unless you're using it for business use, they're quite happy for you to use it free. They just say, please play fair, so that's all good. Anyway, I'll open up TeamViewer. Well, I'm now on the remote computer, which is 100 kilometers away. And I'll go back to my laptop. Okay, so on the remote computer, I'm now going to log into the laptop. Okay. And here we go, we have a connection happening on the laptop. So now on the remote computer, it's a little slow, I have the screen of my laptop coming up. So now let me look at this. There's, just shifted the, there's my laptop, there's the remote computer, and I'm controlling the remote computer which is then controlling the laptop. This is really dumb, I know. Okay, so I'll flip that out of the way. So anything I do on there will be shown on there. So I can move it there. Move it there. So I'm going to go to that window and minimize it. There we go. It's going to take about forever. That's what it should look like at the top. And this is it updating on my iPad. Pretty slow. It's got to update on the remote computer first and then it's got to update back through to my iPad. So that is funny. <laughs> Very slow. Now I can cheat here. I can work on the iPad. I could really cheat and just work off the laptop but I won't. I'll work on the iPad and drag the mouse around and come down to Team Viewer, which I've got down there. Click on Team Viewer, bring it up. Have a look at my partner list. And go to our home PC. Now, yeah, I've logged into a home PC, there's my, oh, and she screens come up, here we go. Okay, so I'm now logged onto the home PC, on the laptop it's showing, the home PC is, but on the iPad we've still yet to update the last three screens, but I'm actually now controlling the home PC, if I look at the iPad, I'll set the iPad up like that. Shift the keyboard back a bit. Here we go, there's the iPad. Now, that screen on the iPad is yet to update from that screen on the laptop, which is yet to update from the screen remotely. Oh, here we go, we're getting an update on the iPad. Ta da, it's appearing. So if you don't quite understand what I've done here, I have connected <laughs> from my iPad out to a remote computer that I have access to, a friend of mine, and back into my laptop and from 
my laptop to the desktop to computer and it's all done through TeamViewer so now I'm controlling my desktop computer I minimize Skype on the desktop computer see I'm doing that there and as soon as I click on it there it should minimize here we go And click minimize, bang. There we go. Now I've got my blog up there. Excellent. Now I wonder how long it's going to take for that to update. Oh, it's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Okay, so I'm going window and window and window. If you can see that, I'll show you. That window there, that's my blog tech tinkering is actually a window that's on the desktop computer and the next window out which is that window there is the laptop computer and the one that is the full screen on the iPad is my mate's computer so if I minimize this Minimize the whole lot. Da -da. That is my mate's computer. So I am controlling my mate's computer. I come down here and I click on Team Viewer. All right, click on Laptop, which is the Team Viewer where I might control. And you can see here I've got Team Viewer free license, non commercial use only, and then that's the IP address there. No, sorry, that's the actual ID. And then I've got Madeline's PC. That's the laptop. So, and the laptop's now controlling Madeline's PC. Now, I'm going to go from Madeline's PC and try and control... Where am I? Try and control the laptop. What am I doing here? Going insane. This just ain't happening. No. Get down here. Here we go. Right, so I need to sign in, oh, where am I, I might be, I'm looking at this now, okay, so here we go, now I should be able to go back to the laptop and double control it and then I will have a snowballing effect, yep, here we go. I'm now double controlling it, and yes, here we go, look at this snowball effect. It's going around in a big circle. <laughs> and it will never end. <laughs> Getting smaller and smaller and going into the distance. Gone. So I'm now getting a team viewer feedback loop using four devices iPad PC laptop PC back to the laptop and watch the same thing happen as it updates